हेलो एवरी वन टूडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ऑफ एक्सरसाइज सेवन पॉइंट टू चैप्टर सेवन फ्रैक्शन द क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ऑफ द एक्सरसाइज इज एक्सप्रेस द फॉलोइंग एज मिक्स फ्रैक्शन हेयर एज यू ऑल कैन सी हेयर इन दिस क्वेश्चन दे हैव गिवन सम ऑफ द फ्रैक्शन एंड आई होप यू इट इज क्लियर टू यू दैट द गिवन फ्रैक्शन ऑल द गिवन फ्रैक्शन आर इन द इम्प्रॉपर फॉर्म तो वॉट वी आर गोइंग टू डू वी आर गोइंग टू कन्वर्ट दीज फ्रैक्शन इन टू द मिक्स फॉर्म there are two steps for converting the fraction for converting improper fraction into the mixed form the first is that we are going to divide the numerator by the denominator how we are going to do that 20 is your in the given fraction a part 20 upon 3 20 is your numerator and 3 is the denominator so we will be dividing 20 by 3 20 by 3 means 20 will come inside and 3 will remain outside remember that the numerator will come inside and denominator will remain outside now i am going to divide these two since you know that 20 will not be completely divided with 3 we will divide it by 6 3 mul multiply by 6 will be 18 so we are going to divide 20 with 6 times and when we will subtract both of them we will get 2 the remainder will be 2 now we have divided it we are not going to divide we are not going to do any other thing now we are going to write our answer we are going to write the given fraction to the mixed form mixed form first i am going to show in this a part since this is the first part i am going to show how you are going to write your answer how you are going to write the fraction with the mixed form we always write the fraction as into the form quotient whole remainder upon divisor what to question first i am going to start with the question so here in this division 6 is your question remainder the answer that that is left to it will be your remainder and divisor d this is your divisor divisor means the number which which is using for division so first is your question question is 6 next is your remainder remainder is 2 and last is your denominator is your divisor divisor is 3 so remember that whenever you are going to convert in uh, any improper fraction into the mixed form you always write the answer in this form so here we are going to write here we used to write the question here we used to write the remainder and in the denominator we used to write div divisor let us see the b part the b part is 11 upon 5 again we have to convert this improper fraction into the mixed form since i am calling it as a improper fraction because here the numerator is greater than the denominator and as i have explained you earlier Uh, in an improper fraction the numerator is always greater than the denominator so for converting this fraction into the mixed form again i am going to divide 11 with 5 so 11 will come inside and 5 will be written outside 5 to the 10 we will subtract both of them and our answer is 1 again now we will be writing the answer you can write over here it's not important to write all this mixed form is equals to q r upon d it's not important you can write the answer directly so the answer is again question question will come over here remainder is 1 it will come over here and divisor is 5 so it will be written over here c part c part is 17 upon 7 17 upon 7 again for this question we will be dividing 17 by 7 17 will come over here 7 we will write 7 outside now we will be dividing these two number 7 to the 14 again when we will subtract both of them 17 minus 14 will be 3 so our answer will be 2 whole 3 upon 7 remember that 2 is your question it will come over here 3 is your remainder it will come in the numerator and 7 is your uh, divisor it will come over here now let us come to the next part d part of the same question 28 upon 5 so the c d part is 28 upon 5 again we have to do the same we have to convert the improper fraction into the mixed form so i'll be dividing 28 by 5 28 divided by 5 55 is 25 we will be subtracting them 3 3 is our remainder so our mixed form will be 5 whole 
यूज टू राइट फाइव ओवर हेयर थ्री अपॉन फाइव क्वेश्चन इज हेयर फाइव थ्री इज द रिमाइंडर इट इज रिटर्न इन द न्यूमरेटर एंड फाइव इज द डिनोमिनेटर इट विल कम ओवर हेयर तो फाइव होल थ्री अपॉन फाइव नाउ लेट एस कम टू द ई पार्ट ई पार्ट इज नाइनटीन अपॉन सिक्स फॉर फॉर दिस ई पार्ट अगेन वी विल बी डिवाइडिंग नाइनटीन बाय सिक्स नाइनटीन विल बी डिवाइडेड विद सिक्स नाउ सिक्स थ्री जा एटीन वेन वी सब बोथ ऑफ दैम वील गेट वन अगेन वी विल बी राइटिंग द आंसर थ्री इज द क्वेश्चन इट विल बी रिटर्न ओवर हेयर थ्री होल वन अपॉन सिक्स लास्ट इज योर एफ पार्ट एफ इज थर्टी फाइव अपॉन नाइन दिस आई होप नाउ यू कैन ट्राई दिस पार्ट योर सेल्फ नाउ लेट एस कम टू द लास्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ दिस एक्सरसाइज क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री द क्वेश्चन इज Express the following as improper fraction. Earlier, they have given the fraction into the improper form, and they were asking us to write them to convert them into the mixed form. This time, they have given the fraction. As you all can see, they have given the fraction into the mixed form, and they are asking us to write them into the improper form. Now, let us start with the A part. It's seven whole three upon four. we have to convert this improper form uh, sorry mix form into the improper form the first thing is there is a simple uh, small formula to convert the mix uh, mix form into the improper form it is uh, we have already written this formula earlier we have whenever we have to write down the imp, uh, mix form into the improper form we always write it as whole multiply by denominator Plus numerator. Earlier, when I was ex explaining the definitions, at that time I have explained it. Divided by denominator. It's not important to write this formula in every part. I have written over here so that we can just write it easily. So whole is your seven. Denominator is your four, and numerator is your three. तो वट वी हाउ वी आर गोइंग टू कन्वर्ट इट होल मल्टीप्लाई बाय डिनोमिनेटर होल इज सेवन मल्टीप्लाई बाय डिनोमिनेटर सेवन मल्टीप्लाई बाय फोर प्लस न्यूमरेटर न्यूमरेटर इज थ्री डिवाइडेड बाय डिनोमिनेटर डिनोमिनेटर इज फोर तो एज यू ऑल नो अकॉर्डिंग टू बोर्ड मास रूल इफ वी आर हैविंग मोर देन टू ऑपरेशन तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल एंड and if we are having any bracket in our expression we always solve the bracket first and then we will solve it then we will move further so now i am going to solve this bracket i'll be multiplying 7 with 4 7 into 4 will be 28 plus 3 divided by 4 i'll be adding these two 28 plus 3 will be 31 upon 4 Now, as you all can see here, we have converted this mixed form into the improper form. Again, let me make you clear. I have called it as improper form because here the numerator is greater than the numerator. That's why this will be your improper fraction. Let us come to the B part. This time, I am not going to do all this. I am not going to write any formula. I will be solving it directly. Five whole six upon seven. It's not important to write this formula and do all these calculations. You can write the answer directly. What I am going to do. Whole multiply by denominator seven multiply by five five multiply by seven will be thirty five plus six thirty five plus six will be forty one upon seven so the answer will be forty one upon seven. Let us come to the C part. C part is two whole five upon six. Again, I am going to write the answer directly. Two whole five upon six. So whole multiply by denominator whole multiply by six will be Sorry, two multiplied by six will be twelve. Twelve plus five, twelve plus five will be seventeen upon six. This is your answer. D part. Ten whole three upon five. Again, ten multiplied by five will be fifty. Fifty plus three will be fifty-three upon five. E part. Nine whole three upon seven. Again, nine multiplied by seven will be sixty-three. 
63 plus 3 will be 66 upon 7. Now your last part F part is 8 whole 4 upon 9. Again we will be doing the same. We will be multiplying whole with the denominator means 8 with 9. 9 8 is a 72 and 72 plus 4 will be 76. The answer will be 76 upon 9. Hence we have got the answer of all the given parts. Uh, I hope it would be clear to you what we are going to do. I am just uh, reminding it again what we are going to do whenever we have to convert the mixed form into the improper form. We are going to use this formula. We will be multiplying whole with the denominator 7 4 is a 28 plus numerator 28 plus 3 will be 31. We have got the numerator as 31 divided by denominator and the denominator is 4. The same we are going to do in the given parts, in the remaining parts. I hope the questions must be clear to you. That's all for today. Thank you.